Welcome everybody to a new episode of Retrocade. I'm your host, Raging Anybody, here for Fat Ninja Studios. I uh, just picked up my copy of Mass Effect Legacy. So, or leg Legendary, sorry. Uh, let's see how this goes. It's the first time I'm using this setup with uh, both um, OBS and the PlayStation. Usually I stream directly from the PlayStation onto their YouTube. So we're gonna try this out. All right, here goes. Let's uh, let's hope my PlayStation still wants to read discs. It's been having a little bit of issues lately. again. Hope this works. Does look pretty. I remember playing this the first time on the 360 back, oh, many years ago. Classic mode, the original 1 to 60 level range will be used instead of the new 1 to 30 level range. XP and talent points progression remains the same with the number of levels as it doubles. I don't know what that means. to Alliance Military Database. Classified information requested. Establishing secure connection. Secure connection confirmed. Please. Custom female. 
Log in to access your profile. Warning, data corruption detected. Please reconstruct profile. Confirm pre-service history. Hours spent on ship stations as they transferred from post and post and they were staying in one location. Uh... Confirm psychological profile. Confirm military specialization. Stick with soldier. Confirm facial identification.
Profile reconstruction complete. Identification confirmed. We'll find out if legendary mode is any cooler or worse. We'll see. 30 levels. I kind of like hitting level 50. I wonder what the trophies are. Well, what about Shepard? She grew up in the colonies. She knows how tough life can be out there. Her parents were killed when slavers attacked Midwar. Man, Keith she David proved herself during the blitz. The unrequited off enemy hero forces to the ground until reinforcements of all sci-fi. She's the only voice. This is just adds thing. gravitas. We, we can't can question her courage. courage. Humanity needs a hero, and Shepard's the best we've got. I'll make the call. Internal emission sink engaged. All systems online. Drift. Drift. Just under 1500 kcal. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. I hate that guy. Not as good as you can't. So you hate him. You remember a zip up with jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped just halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. That's, That's incredible. incredible. Besides, Spectres are trouble. I don't like I don't having them on board. board. Call me Call paranoid. paranoid. You're paranoid. You're paranoid. The, council the council helped fund this project. project. They have, they a, have right a right to send, to send someone, someone to keep an, an eye, eye on the investment. Yeah, yeah that, that is, is the, the official, official story. story. Only an idiot believes the official, the official story. story. They don't send Spectres on shakedown runs. So there's more going on here than the captain's letting on. Joker. Status report. Just cleared, Just cleared the mass, the mass relay, relay, Captain. Captain. Stealth, Stealth systems, systems engaged. engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Good. Find the comm buoy and link us into the network. I want, I want mission reports to relayed back to Alliance Brass before we change your Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace, brace yourself, yourself, sir. sir. Think now is the way. way. He's, He's already here. here. Tell, Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? Great. Great. You, you pissed, pissed the captain, the captain off, off, and now I'm gonna pay for it. it. <laughs> Don't blame me. The captain's, the captain's always in a bad mood. Only when he's talking to you, you, you Joker. Joker. The captain's waiting for you, Commander. You probably don't want to keep the captain waiting,
Congratulations, Commander. Commander. Looks, like, Looks we like we had a smooth, smooth run. run. You heading down, down to, to see the captain? captain? Sounds, Sounds like, like you don't, you don't trust, trust our three guests. guests. Sorry, Sorry, Commander. Just having a chat with Adams, Adams down in engineering didn't mean to cause any trouble. But you have to admit, something's odd about this mission. The whole crew feels it. You think the Alliance brass is holding out on us? All we're, All we're supposed, supposed to, do to do is test, test out the out stealth system. system. Why, Why is Captain, Captain Anderson, Anderson in charge? charge? And then there's Nihilus. Spectres, Spectres are elite, elite operatives, operatives, top covert agents. agents. Why, Why send a Spectre, a turn, a turn Spectre, on a shakedown? It doesn't, it doesn't add, add up. up. What do you what know, do you about, know about, about the stealth systems? systems? I, just I just know it masks our location, our location scans, scans, and sensors, cutting edge technology. technology. The Normandy is the only ship with this prototype to drive. Why are, Why are we fully staffed? Stand? A skeleton, skeleton crew would be cheap, less, less chance of security, security too. too. Plus, there's no It's pretty it's obvious the shit shit down is just a cover. For what? For what? Damn, Damn if I know, come in. We're, We're out here on false pretenses. I'm, I'm not a fan of being left out of the dark. Do you have a you problem with the cap captain? No, man. But I can't figure out what he's doing here. Captain Anderson, Anderson is one of the most decorated special forces officers in the service. If he melted down, down all his mountains, he could make a life-size life statue of himself. himself. You, you don't, don't send, send a soldier like that out and do, do nothing, nothing mission. He's treating his shit down, down too seriously. seriously. Something, Something big, big is going, going on. on. You don't you trust Nihilus. I don't like Turians in general. Runs in my family. My grandfather fought in the first contact war. Lost a lot of friends when the Turians hit us. Nihilus, Nihilus is no, is no ordinary, ordinary Turian. Turian. You've got You've that right, right Commander. Commander. We're an We're alliance, alliance vessel, vessel human, human military. military. But Nihilus, Nihilus doesn't, doesn't answer to the captain and the rest of us. Spectres, Spectres operate, operate outside, outside the normal, normal chain, chain. command. And they don't, and they don't come, come along just, just to observe shape shape downs. <laughs> Nihilus, Nihilus looks like he's expecting some heavy action. I know, I don't get it. I'll see if I can get some answers when I see him. Good luck, Commander. What do you think, Commander? We won't be staying on Eden Prime too long, will we? I'm itching for some real act. I sincerely hope you're kidding, Corporal. Your real action usually ends with me patching up crew members in the infirmary. You need to calm down, Corporal. A good soldier stays cool even under fire. Sorry, Sorry, Commander, but this waiting's this killing, killing me. I've never, I've never been, been on a on mission, mission like this before, not with the Spectre on board. What can you what tell can you me tell about Nihilus? Turians, Turians are generally well-respected well by the other species. species. Their, Their fleet has, has more patrols, patrols protecting Citadel space, space than any other. They don't, they don't always, always get on well, well with us, us though. Some, Some people, people find them too rigid. Others still play late for the first contact. As, As for Nihilus, Nihilus I, haven't I haven't said more than two words to him. He usually, he usually only speaks to the captain. I heard Nihilus, Nihilus once took down an entire enemy platoon all by himself. Man, I can't, can't believe I'm on a mission with an actual Spectre. What do you know, do you know about, about the Spectres? Spectres? Only, what, only what, what I've heard. heard. Spectre, Spectre agents, agents work directly for the Citadel, Citadel Council. Council. They usually they work alone or in small groups. groups. Spectres, Spectres don't, don't have any official power, though. Basically, they're, They're a shadow, shadow organization with a mandate to preserve and protect galactic, galactic stability. Protect it at any cost. Don't, Don't forget, forget that, that part. part. Spectres, Spectres operate above, above the law. Why don't Why we, we have, have any of our own, own people, people in there? there? Spectres, Spectres usually, usually come, come from the council, council races, races, like the Turians. We've been We've trying, trying to get, to get a human accepted, accepted into their ranks, ranks for years now. So far, it hasn't happened. Hey, Commander, you'd make a good Spectre. You're a war hero, hero, right? right? Held off an entire enemy fleet during the Blitz single-handed? That's the kind of talent the Spectres are looking for. This is all just wild speculation. The Spectres aren't interested in recruiting humans, no matter how capable. How do you control agents with unlimited power? I suppose the Council could revoke the Spectre status of an agent who got out of hand. At that point, Citadel Security Services would take over. Those C-Sec grunts wouldn't stand a chance. The Spectres were 20 ordinary soldiers. The Spectres police themselves. An the agent goes rogue, they send another agent to take them down. That's Spectre justice. The Corporal's confusing romantic legends with reality, Commander. 
How do you control agents with unlimited power? I suppose the council's... The Spectre's police... The corporal's confusing romantic legends with reality, Commander. You're from Eden Prime, aren't you, Jenkins? What's it like? It's very peaceful, Commander. They've been, They've been real, real careful, careful with development, with development so, you so you don't have, have any city, city noise or pollution. My parents, parents lived on the, on the outskirts of the colony. At night, At night I, used I used to climb this big hill, hill and stare across the fields back, back at the lights of the main settlement. It was gorgeous. gorgeous. But, but when I got, when I got older, older, I realized, I realized it, was it was a little, little too calm and quiet for me. For me. That's, That's why I joined the Alliance. Even Paradise gets boring after a while. Any idea why Eden Prime was chosen as our destination? Not really sure, Commander. Eden Prime is one of our most stable colonies. Good place, good place to take the Normandy for a shakedown run, I guess. No, no real danger, danger there. there. There's gotta got be something, something else going, going on. on. We've got a We've got Spectre on board. That's why I'm so wound, so wound up. Can't wait, Can't for, the wait for the real mission to start. start. Just, treat Just treat this like every other assignment you've had and everything will work out. Easy for you to say. You proved yourself in Blitz. Everybody knows what you can do. This is my big chance. I need to show the brass what I can do. You're young, Corporal. You have a long career ahead of you. Don't do, Don't something, do something stupid, stupid to mess, mess it up. up. Don't worry, ma'am. I'm not going to screw this up. up. The captain's, the captain's waiting, waiting for me. me. Goodbye, Goodbye Shepard, I was hoping, I was hoping you'd, you'd get here, here first. first. We'll give us a, a chance, chance to, talk. to talk. The captain, captain said he'd meet me here. here. He's, on, He's his on his way. way. I'm, I'm interested, interested in this in world we're going, going to. to. Eden, Eden Prime. Prime. I've, heard I've heard it's, it's quite, quite beautiful. beautiful. They say they it's say a paradise. paradise. Yes, yes, a paradise. Serene, Serene tranquil, tranquil safe. safe. Eden, Eden Prime has become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Do you know something? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. I figured there was something you weren't telling us. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operation. There must, there must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was profound. The Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relay is a citadel of our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is big change. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interest, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Why didn't we keep the beacon for ourselves? You humans don't have the best reputation. Some species see you as selfish, too unpredictable, too independent, even dangerous. Sharing that beacon will improve relations with the Council. Plus, we need their scientific expertise. They know more about the Prothean I can't reach the internet right now. Check your modem or router connection and try again. Neither of us wants to see you in action. He's here to do that. Commander, 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 if they, if they accept, accept the human to their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. come. You held off an enemy assault during your blitz single-handed. You, you showed show not only courage, courage, but also incredible, incredible skill. skill. That's, That's why, why I put your, your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. Why would, why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. Some of us see the potential for species. We see what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy, and to the Spectres. We are, we are an elite, elite group. group. It's, it's rare, rare to find, to find an individual with the skills we seek. I don't care that you're human, Shepard. 
I only care that you can do the job. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth needs the ship. We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the brown team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Now is the company to observe the mission. What do you know about the Protheans? Just as the in school. They were a technologically advanced species that ruled the galaxy 50,000 years ago. Then they vanished. Nobody really knows how or why, though I agree with that 50 years. But everyone agrees. Galactic civilization wouldn't exist as that one. Their citadel is the very heart of galactic society. And without their mass relays, interstellar travel would be impossible. We all owe the Protheans a great debt. I'd like to know more about Eden Prime before we touch down. It's a peaceful farming world. But it but represents it something much bigger. Eden Prime, Prime is one of our oldest and most successful companies. It proved we were ready to face the challenges of settling new worlds, to forge a place for humanity beyond Earth. Earth. It symbolizes humanity's growth and evolution of the space and species. And after this, it will be known as the world where humans made the discovery of galactic importance. Why is this beacon so important? All advanced galactic civilization is based on Prothean technology. Even yours. yours. If we, we hadn't had discovered those Prothean ruins buried on Mars, we'd still be stuck on Earth. That was just a small data cache. Who knows what we can learn from this beacon? What if it's a weapons archive? We can't let it fall into the wrong hands. Like who? The Attica Converse isn't the most stable sector of citizens. There are plenty of raiders and criminal groups active in the region. They might figure a Prothean beacon is worth the risk of attacking an alliance ship. Plus, Eden Prime, Prime is right on the border of the Terminus system. system. The Attican Traverse is under Citadel protection. protection. If the, the Terminus, Terminus system attacks, attack, it's an act of war. war. Technically, Technically yes. yes. But some, some of the species of Terminus might, might be willing to start a war over this. The last thing the Council wants is to get dragged into a major conflict with the Terminus system. We have to keep this low key. Just, Just give the word, Captain. Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission, Transmission from Eden Prime, Prime sir. sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Get down! Traffic at all. Just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse hold 38.5. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. When I first played this game, I always look like a giant hand is reaching down. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You go in. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. We've got his back, Captain. The mission's yours, now, Shepard. Good luck! We are approaching drop point two. Ship perimeter 
security, Commander. It smells like smoke and death. Oh, God. What happened here? This place got hot, hard, Commander. Hostiles. Roof's pretty fluid. proper service once the mission is complete, but I need you to stay focused.
know there's a spot up ahead where I have to bypass something. I'm gonna do the old school save right beforehand. So if I screw it up, I can reload my save. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. He the one in charge here, ma'am? Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't, I don't think, think any of the others. others. I think I'm the only one left. left. This isn't your fault, Williams. You couldn't have done anything to save him. Yes, yes ma'am. We, we held our position as long as we could, could until, until the Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't, haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, ma'am. It's time for payback. What else do you know about the Geth? Just what I remember from history class back in school. They're synthetics, not organic life forms with limited AI programming, created by the Quarians a few centuries ago. They were supposed to be a source of cheap labor, but ended up turning on the Quarians and drove them into exile. Well, after that, they just kind of disappeared behind the Perseus veil. Nobody's, Nobody's really heard much of them since. Tell me, Tell me everything, everything you know about the beacon. They were, they were doing, doing some digging out here to extend the monorail and expand the colony. colony. A, few A few weeks ago, ago they unearthed some Prothean ruins, ruins. And, and the beacon. The beacon. Suddenly, Suddenly every, every scientific, scientific expert in the colony, colony was interested. That's, That's when, they when they brought us in to secure the site. site. I, don't I don't know much about, about the beacon, beacon itself, itself, but I heard one of the researchers say this could be the biggest scientific discovery of the century. What happened to the researchers from the dig site? I don't know. They set up camp near the beacon. The 232 was with them. Maybe their unit fared better than mine. Describe what happened leading up to the attack. We were sent out a couple of nights ago from the main colony to secure the area. It seemed like routine patrol until the gap at us. We never knew they were coming. Have you seen a Turian Spectre around here? There aren't any Turians on even time. None that I've ever met. Not, not sure I'd be able, able to tell if one was a Spectre anyway. If you, if you saw, saw this, this guy, guy, you'd know. He carries enough firepower to wipe out a whole platoon. Luckily, he's on our side. Sorry. Like, Sorry. like I said, that Move out! Move out!
This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side of the gas. Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Thank the Maker. Hurry, Hurry. Close, close the door, the door before, before they come, they come back. back. Don't worry, we'll protect, we'll protect you. you. Thank, Thank you. you, I think, I think we'll, we'll be okay, okay now. now. It, it looks, looks like, like everyone's, everyone's gone. gone. 
You're Dr. Dr. Warren, Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know, Do what, you know happened what happened to the beacon? beacon? It was, it was moved, moved to the spaceport space this morning. morning. Manuel, Manuel and I stayed, stayed behind, behind to help pack, pack up the camp. camp. When, when the attack, attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one was saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses remain. What else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment. The next we were hiding in the shed while the guests swarmed over the camp. Agents of the destroyers, bringers of darkness, heralds of our extinction. We could hear the battle outside, gunfire, screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there, too afraid to move, until you came along. Did you know a Tori in the area? I saw him, the prophet, leader of the enemy. He was here, before the attack. That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the normal before, before the attack. attack. He couldn't have been here. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. Manuel's, Manuel's still a bit unsettled. unsettled. We, haven't we haven't seen your Turian. We've been, We've been hiding, hiding in here since the attack. attack. Can, you Can you tell me tell anything me about, about the beacon? beacon? It's, it's some, some type, type of data, data module from, from a galaxy-wide galaxy -wide communication network. Remarkably, remarkably well, well preserved. preserved. It, could it could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies. Groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? We have, we have unearthed the heart of evil. evil. Awaken, Awaken the beast! The beast. Unleash the, the darkness! Manuel, Man, well, please. please. This isn't this the time. time. What's, What's wrong, wrong with your assistant? assistant? Manuel, Manuel has, has a brilliant, a brilliant, mind, brilliant mind, mind, but he's, he's always been, been a bit unstable. unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No, I, I am, am not, not mad. mad. I'm, I'm the, the only, only sane one, one left. I gave I him an extra dose, dose of his meds after the attack. attack. Williams, Williams, take us, take to, us to the spaceport. Space you can't you can stop, stop it. it. Nobody, Nobody can, can stop it. Night, Night is falling. falling. The, the darkness, darkness of eternity. eternity. Hush, Hush Manuel, go lie down. down. You'll, You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. Yes. yes. Is there something, something you need? We better, better get moving. moving. Good luck, Good luck Commander. Commander. Luck will save you. Left on the search.
Sarah. Sarah. This, is... this isn't this your, is mission, your mission, Sarah. Sarah. What, are what are you doing, doing here? here? The council thought you could use some help. help this was I wasn't it wasn't expected to get here. The situation, situation was bad. Don't worry. Don't worry. I've got it under control. control. Stay, stay calm, calm out, there. out there. We're coming, we're coming out, out, we're not we're armed. armed. Is it Is safe? safe? Are they gone? You're, You're okay, okay now. now. Nobody's, Nobody's gonna, gonna hurt you. you. Those, Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would've, they would've found, found us for, for sure. sure. We owe you we lives. lives. Uh, uh, I, I, I can't, can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. It was trouble the second I saw it. We made a break for the sheds. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three, the three of us were working, working on crops on that ship showed, showed up. We just, we just saw, saw it and ran. ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were, they by, were the by the garage, over near, over the, near space the space port, right, right, right where that ship came down. down. No, no way they survived. survived. You don't you know don't that. that. We survived. If they if made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance. Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise pool. That awful noise. It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like like the shriek of the dam. Only we was coming from the side of the head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing through my skull. Almost made it impossible to think. I have to go. Hey, Cole, Cole, we're just, we're a, just bunch a bunch of farmers. farmers. These, guys These guys are soldiers. soldiers. They didn't they shoot should give us this stuff. Jeez, Jeez Blake, Blake, you gotta, gotta learn when to shut, shut up. up. You have something, you have something to, tell to tell me, Cole? Me, Cole? Some, Some guys at the space board were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing, Nothing major. major. In exchange, exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. What kind of packages? I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But they'll probably get more use out of it than we will. We're risking our lives to save this colony. You sure, you sure there's nothing, nothing else in here that can help us out? Yeah, yeah there's, there's one, one more thing. thing. I was gonna, I was gonna sell, sell it after this was over, but probably deserves it more than I do. Who's, Who's your, your contact, contact at the spaceport, space Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. He might have something to do with this whole attack, Cole. We need his name. It's important. Yeah, okay, right. His name's, His name's Powell. Powell. Works the docks, the docks at the spaceport. Space he's still, still alive. alive. I have to I go. Have to go. Good luck. Good luck.
Wait, Wait! Don't! Don't! Don't shoot! I'm one of you! I'm human! Sneaking, Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed! I, I am sorry I was hiding, hiding from those creatures. From those creatures. My name's Pal. I saw what happened to that Turian. The, the other one shot him. I need to I know how Nihilus, Nihilus died. died. Uh, the other the one got here first. first. He was he waiting when your friend showed up. He, he called he him called Sarah. Sarah. I, 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 think I think they knew they each other. Your friends, Your friends seemed to relax. relax. He let, he let his, guard his guard down. down. And Sarah, Sarah killed you. Shot, shot him right in the back. back. Just, Just lucky, lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. crates. We were told we a Prothean beacon was brought from Space Fort. What happened to it? It's over it's on the, on other, the platform. other platform, probably, probably where that where guy Saren, Saren was, headed. was headed. He hopped, he hopped on the cargo, on the cargo train, train right after he killed your friend. friend. I knew that beacon was, was trouble. Everything's gone, gone to hell, hell since, since we found, found it. it. There's that, There's that damn, damn mothership, mothership showed up. Showed up. And the and attack? attack? They killed, they killed everyone. 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 If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They, they never, never had, had a chance. chance. <clears throat> I, 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 was I was already behind, behind the, crates the crates when the attack, when the attack started. started. Wait a Wait minute. minute. You were you hiding, hiding behind the crates, crates before, before the attack? attack? I, I, sometimes I need a nap to get through my ship. I, I, I sneak off behind, behind the crates, crates to grab 40 wings where the supervisor, supervisor can't find. find. You survived because you're lazy? If you had you snuck, snuck off, off that, that map, you'd probably be dead, dead just like just all the like others. others. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah, guess. I, guess. I, don't I don't really, really want, want to think, think of it. Tell, Tell me about, about the Geth, the Geth attack. attack. It was quick. One minute, One minute the ship was descending, the next. Those Geth, Those Geth were swarming over the platform. platform. Thousands, Thousands of them. They must have been inside that mothership. They shot everything that moved. It was a massacre. Is there, Is there anything, anything else, else you can, can tell me about, about the beacon? beacon? They, brought they brought it here, here this, morning. this morning. We loaded, we loaded it up onto the, onto the train and shipped it to the other platform. platform. Hard, to Hard to believe that was only a few hours ago. Feels like a whole other life. life. Tell me about, tell this, about this mothership, mothership you saw. I've never seen anything like it before. It was huge. 
landed, landed over, over near, near that, that platform. platform. The whole the place, place got, got dark, dark as it came, came down. down. And it, it was, was making, making this noise. This is this this how bored, bored right, right into your, into your brain. brain. This woke, woke me up. up. The attack came a few minutes later. Your calls contact here on the docks for the smuggling ring. What? what? No! no. Uh, I mean, I mean, what does it matter, matter now? now? So I'm a so smuggler. Who cares? cares? My supervisor's, My supervisor's dead. dead. The entire, entire crew's dead. dead. Doesn't, matter doesn't matter now, does it? Anything, Anything hidden, hidden nearby that we could use, use against the Geth? A shipment, a shipment of grenades, grenades came through last week. week. Nobody, Nobody notices if a few small pieces go missing from the military orders. You, you greedy son, son of a bitch. bitch. We're, We're out here trying to protect your sorry ass. And all you can think about is how you can rip us off? I never, I never thought, thought you'd actually, actually need those grenades. Those grenades. Who'd, Who'd want to attack Eden Prime, Prime with just a bunch of farmers? farmers. How, was How was I supposed to know? Forget, Forget about him. him. He's, He's not, not worth it. it. You're, You're lucky, lucky the commander is here, pal. Hand out those grenades. grenades. They're, They're yours. yours. Take, Take them. them. My, My smuggling days are over, I swear. A lot of Marines died here, pal. Those grenades could come in handy. If I were you, I'd think of some way to make it up to them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. There, there is, is something, something else, else I was saying. saying. Could be worth a fortune. Experimental technology, technology top, top of the line. Take, Take it. it. I don't, I don't need, need it. it. I, I didn't want anyone want to get hurt. hurt. Really, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We, need we need to find, find that beacon before, before it's too late. late. Take, Take the, the cargo, cargo train. train. That's, That's where the other Turian went. went. I, I, I can't stay. I need to get away from all this.
Accept the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planned it. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. I kind of like the Geth as an enemy. They always reminded me a little bit of uh, <clears throat> the Borg from Star Trek, but a little bit more uh, cool looking. I know there was a
Normandy, Normandy, the beacon, the beacon is, is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. Something must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. I think she's what you hung up. Who 
You had us worried there, Chef. How are you feeling? Minor throbbing. Nothing serious. How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. You have no way to know what had happened. Actually, we don't even know if that's what set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get a chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system of the maybe. The blast knocked out cold. Williams and I need to carry you back here to the ship. I appreciate it. Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain activity. Abnormal beta waves. I also, I also noticed, noticed an increase in your, in your rapid, rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. I saw... I'm not I'm sure what I saw. Death, Death destruction... Nothing from the area. Hmm. I better, I better add this to my report. report. It may, may... Oh. oh. Captain, Captain Anderson. Anderson. How's our exo holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings are normal. I tell the commander's going to be fine. fine. Glad, Glad to hear it. Shepard, Shepard, I need to speak to you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. Captain. I'll, I'll be in the mess, mess if you need me. Sounds, Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty, pretty hard, hard. Are, you Are you sure, sure you're, you're okay? okay? I don't, I don't like, like soldiers, soldiers dying, dying by my command. Jenkins, Jenkins wasn't your fault. fault. You did you a did good job, Shepard. Did we leave Gunnery Chief Williams back on Eden Prime? I figured we could use a soldier like that. She's been reassigned to the Nome. Williams, Williams is a good soldier. soldier. She, she deserves, deserves it. it. Lieutenant Allegro agrees with you. with you. That's, That's why, why I added her to our crew. crew. Intel, Intel dropped the ball, sir. We had, we had no, no idea, idea what we were walking, walking into down there. That's why Flanks went to hell. The Geth haven't been outside the Vale in two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have contained this. You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie, Things look bad. Nihilus, Nihilus is dead. dead. The beacon the was destroyed and get there The council's, council's going, going to want answers. answers. I didn't, I didn't do, anything do anything wrong, Captain. Captain. Hopefully, Hopefully the council, council can see that. that. I'll stand I'll behind you and your reports, sir. You're a you're damn, damn hero, hero, my books. books. That's, That's not why. why. It's Sarah. That other two. Sarah's, Sarah's a spectre. One of the best. best. A living legend. But, but if he's working with the gift, it means he's gone rogue. A rogue, rogue spectre is trouble. Sarah is dangerous. And he hates the humans. Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, fast taking over the galaxy. A lot, a lot of aliens think that way. Most, most of them don't know do anything about it. it. But Sarah, Sarah has allied himself in the gap. Yeah. I don't know how. I don't know why. I, I only know, know it's something, something to do with that beacon. beacon. You were there just before that beacon self destructed. Did you see anything? Any, Any clue that might tell us what Saren, Saren was after? Just before, before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. vision. A vision? A vision of what? I saw, I saw some things. things. Gaff, yeah, maybe. maybe. Slaughtering, Slaughtering people. people. Butchering them. We, we need, need to, to report this to the council. <laughs> what are we, what are we gonna, gonna tell them? them? I had a bad dream? dream? We don't, we don't know, know what, what information is stored in that thing. Lost, Lost Prothean technology, technology blueprints for something, ancient, ancient weapon of mass destruction, whatever it was. Sarah, Sarah took it. But I know Sarah. Sarah. I know his reputation is politics. He, he believes humans are a blind light galaxy. galaxy. This, this attack, attack is an act of war. war. He, he has, has the secrets from the beacon. He, he has an army of Geth in his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. I'll find, I'll find some, some way, way to take him down. down. It's, it's not, not that easy. He's a suspect. He can, he can go, go anywhere, do almost anything. anything. That's, That's why, why we need the council, council on our side. We, we proved Saren's, Saren's gone rogue, rogue and the council, and the council will revoke his spectre status. I'll, I'll contact, contact the ambassador and see if he can get us an audience with the council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the citadel. We should be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. Thank <laughs> you.
is kind of cold and sterile. Yes, yes, Commander. Commander. Is there something, something you need? How did you, you end up serving on an Alliance ship? ship? I enlisted I right out of med school. school. Earth, Earth always, always seemed boring, boring to me, to too safe, safe too secure. secure. I, figured I figured the colonies, colonies were teeming with, with exotic, exotic adventure. adventure. I, wanted I wanted to travel the stars, tending, tending the wounds of tough soldiers, soldiers with piercing eyes and sensitive, sensitive souls. souls. <laughs> Turns out military life isn't quite as romantic as I'd imagined. But humanity, humanity needs, needs the Alliance, the alliance if, we if we want to keep expanding, expanding through the Traverse. And the Alliance, and the alliance always, always needs good doctors. doctors. So I stayed on to do my part. Ever, Ever think you made the wrong choice? choice? Sometimes, Sometimes I think, I think about, about opening a private practice back on Earth. Or maybe, or maybe taking a position at one of the new med centers out in the colonies. But there's something special about working on soldiers. If I left the Alliance now, I'd feel like I was abandoning them. What do you know about Captain Anderson? I've served, I've served with him for a few, few tours, tours now. now. He knows when to let things slide and when to crack the whip. The, the crew knows he's pretty, pretty much anything they'll, they'll ever run into. into. And, and he cares, cares about the people under his command. command. How, well How well do you know the lieutenant? lieutenant? I'd never, I'd never worked, worked with him before this mission. But he has, he has an, impressive an impressive service record. record. Over a dozen special commendations. Tends to keep to himself there. Maybe because of the headaches. It's not easy being an L2. What does that have to do with it? Well, well, most, most biotics, biotics now use the L3 implants. Lieutenant Alenko was wired with the old L2 configuration. Sometimes, Sometimes there are complications. complications. What kind of complications? Severe, Severe mental, mental disabilities, mental disabilities insanity, insanity, crippling physical, crippling physical pain. pain. There's a long, long list, list of horrific side, side effects. Hayden's lucky. He just he gets, gets migraines. migraines. I, should I should go. go. Goodbye, Goodbye, Commander. Commander. <laughs> I'm glad, I'm glad you're okay, you're Commander. Commander. The crew could use, use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. Jenkins, Jenkins was, was a valuable, valuable part of this crew. Part of, part of me feels <laughs> guilty over what happened. If Jenkins was still alive, I might, I might not, not be here. here. You're, you're a good, good soldier, soldier Williams. Williams. You belong on Normandy. Thanks, Thanks Commander. Commander. That means that a lot to me. I've never met anyone who was awarded the Star of Terra. Things were pretty rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before. Comes with being, being a marine. marine. But to see my whole unit wiped, wiped out. out. And, and you never get used to seeing dead civilians. civilians. But things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't shown up. We couldn't, we couldn't have done, done it without you, Williams. Thanks, Thanks, Commander. I have, I have to admit, admit I, was I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy. Normandy. It's, it's nice when nice someone makes you feel welcome. welcome. I think I you're going to fit in here just fine, Williams. Thanks, Commander. Go speak, speak to Joko when you're ready. Tell him to bring the normal normally to the dock. Yeah, your quarters are kind of like empty, bro. Family photos, nothing. What up? Commander, Commander I'm glad, glad to see you're okay. okay. Losing Jenkins was hard on the crew. I'm glad, I'm glad we, we lose you too. too. Things were pretty rough down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah I never, never get used to seeing the dead civilians. Doesn't, doesn't, doesn't seem right. right. But at, but at least, least you stopped, stopped Sarah, Sarah from, from wiping out the whole colony. colony. I couldn't, I couldn't have done, done it without you. you. We're, We're Marines. Marines. We, we stick, stick together. together. And I'm, I'm just, just sorry, sorry we lost Jenkins. Yeah, I wish yeah, we could have done, done something to save him. I was, I was there. there. Did, did everything right. It was just, just bad luck. It's been a hell of a shakedown, Cruz. Our first mission ends one spec to killing another. The Citadel Council's not going to be happy about that. Probably using the level of concession shot on the lines. You've got a good grasp of the situation. You a career man? man? Yeah, a lot of biotics are. We're not restricted, but we sure don't go on May as well get a good edge for him. Besides, my father's concerned. Made him proud of his decision. Eventually. But is that why you're here? Because of your family? My family were homesteaders on Noir. I'm the only one. 
Imagine, Imagine that, that thought, thought you were most asleep. Where are you heading for the Citadel, ma'am? Can you, uh, tell me why? why? The, captain the captain hopes the ambassador, the ambassador can get an audience with the council. Tell them, tell them what Saren's been up to. Makes, Makes sense. sense. They'd, They'd probably, probably like to know he's not working for them anymore. Whatever happens, we'll be right back. Looking for some extra supplies, supplies before, before you head? What have you, what have you got? got? Whatever, Whatever you want. want. Armor, Armor weapons, weapons, mods. It's, it's not, not standard, standard alliance issue, issue, but that's, that's not necessarily, necessarily a bad, bad thing. thing. Well, well, as, as long, long as you don't, you don't mind, mind. Hey, hey. Why should why I pay, pay you for my weapons and armor? My stuff doesn't, doesn't come from the alliance. alliance. I have to purchase it myself, and it's not cheap. Hell, the licenses alone have set me back more than I'd like. But no licenses, no goods. Without the goods, goods, I'm out, I'm out of a job. job. What are licenses? Why do you need them? Manufacturers, Manufacturers sell, sell licenses. Each, Each license, license allows me to buy and sell a certain brand of product. product. I, already I already have, have several, several basic, basic ones, ones, but you'll need, need to buy more, more if you want me to bring in different brands. brands. Many, Many of the best, best licenses are hard to get, but they're well worth the cost if you can find them. What do the different manufacturers offer? There are too many for me to keep track of, but each license will explain what it's good for. How often, how often will you get, get new items? items? Well, that, well, that depends, depends on how many, how many licenses, licenses you've purchased. But I'll rotate items, items on a regular basis regardless. And anytime, and anytime we land someplace with a big enough port, port I'll, I'll buy, sell, sell, and trade whatever, whatever I can. can. Check, Check back, back off. off. I, need I need to move, to move items, items quickly, quickly, so only so the most the basic, basic items will be stocked consistently. consistently. Let's see what you got. You bet. making some dollars. Alright, check out the friggin' core here. Yeah, look at that beauty.
is hard enough. Just about, about to bring, to bring us into the, the citadel. citadel. See that, that tax pair money at work. work. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy. Request on permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. Normandy, this is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to Dock 422. This is an outrage! outrage. The, Council the Council would step, step in if they get attacked a Turian, Turian colony? colony? The Turians, the Turians don't, don't found colonies, colonies on the borders of the Terminus, terminus systems, systems. Ambassador. Ambassador. Humanity, Humanity is, is well aware of the risks when we wait to the universe. What about Sarah? You, you can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action! action. You, you don't, don't get, get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Sarah. We will, we will discuss, discuss the CSEC findings, findings at the hearing, hearing not, not before. before. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren is their top agent. They don't, they don't like, like him being accused of treason. Seren's a threat to every human colony out there. He needs to be stopped. The Council has to listen to us. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Seren's fault, not hers. Then, then we better, better hope, hope the CSEC investigation, investigation turns some evidence to support our accusations. Our accusations. Otherwise, Otherwise, the Council, the council might use this as an excuse, excuse to keep you out of the spectators. Come, Come with me, Captain. Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, Shepard you and the you others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians.
Seem you seem distressed. distressed. Is there something, is there something I, can I can do to help? help? Alarm, Alarm response. response. You overheard that, didn't you? This is all going so wrong. And, and it is the Asari Consort's fault. She's the one who started all this. Who's this Asari Consort? Curious, you have not heard. You must be new to the Citadel. Everyone will be shut your head at the Consort. I cannot I speak more on this problem. It is too sensitive. Suffice it to say, she has she compromised, compromised my authority as a diplomat. Where can Where I, can find, I find, this find this Asari consort? consort? She is across the bridge of people. Her offices are busy enough to suspect. Good day, We are breathing. It's always good to see you in I am Ambassador Kaylon, genuine query. Is there something I can do for you this day? Why do you explain what you're about to say? Our people communicate less through words and more through sentence like my limits. Plainly, we discovered our vocal expression was not enough to convey the feelings of our conversations to other species. Why do Why you bother, Kaylin? These Earth Clan, Clan don't, don't really, really care, care about our ways. Remorseful response, Din. You don't truly believe that. that. And if you do, I am very sorry, sorry for you. Tell me Tell more about, about your species. Genuine enthusiasm. I don't like to tell the history of my people. It is as if we share our culture with others. Tell me, Tell me about, about the history, history and origins of the Elkhorn. The Elkhorn was just beginning to explore Council's space when the Asari first made contact with us. us. With their help, we discovered the Ruby closest to our system and from there the Citadel. Probably. Within one lifetime, we established a regular route to the Citadel and quickly became one of the more active species living on this great station. I'd like, I'd to, like know to know more about, about the culture of the Elkhorn. Frankly, we don't prefer the safety and familiarity of our own colonies to the confines of space travel. Our society is built on small, tight knit groups. Though we are always welcoming to outsiders, our government tends to be very stable. Our people are not very comfortable with such changes. What do you do here? Modestly, I work, work to bring the problems and the requests of the Elkhor workers to the attention of the Council. <laughs> they only give us this position to keep us quiet. The Council doesn't care about our races. Chastising the rebuke. Your tone is inappropriate, Dan. This human is not to blame for your malcontent or your illicit seeming suspicions. Goodbye, Ambassador. Sincere farewell. Good day to you, Quinlan. Enjoy your time on the Citadel. Earth Clan, you are in the wrong place, I think. Your ambassador is next door in the large office. Chastising remark. Don't be so rude, Dan. At least introduce yourself. I am Din Kork. Volus Ambassador, Ambassador. Is, there is there something, something I, can I can do for you, you Earth Clan? You seem to have a bit of a chip, a chip on your shoulder, Din. Din. You, you humans, humans are new to the Citadel, Citadel. and yet and the, the Council, Council has granted, granted you great, great favor. favor. <sighs> Just as it would be, you, Din. Your species has always been granted many sessions. 
Nicola's territory has expanded tenfold since coming to the Citadel. <coughs> Details. We still, we still have, have no way to say decisions that affect Citadel space. What is this place? You are the embassy for the Vols and the Elko. Your ambassador is next door, in his own office. In this shared space, I aid my fellow Volus when I'm not being interrupted. I'd like to know more about the Volus. I'm sure our history and culture were born earth clan. Actually, I would like to know more about your history. My people came to the Citadel shortly, shortly after, after the Asari and Salarians had discovered it. We were, we were instrumental, instrumental in establishing, in establishing a, standardized a standardized galactic economy. economy. However, despite our long association, association with the Citadel, with the Citadel and our many contributions to galactic society, we, we still, still do not hold a seat, seat on the council. council. Tell, Tell me about Bola's culture. culture. We are, we are tribal, tribal by, by nature, nature, but our, our ways, ways are not, are not violent. violent. We barter and, and trade, trade our lands and, and tribe members, members in order to increase status. Larger, larger tribes often engulf smaller ones, ones and eventually split again. Our, our society is very malleable, and our, and our government, government is always shifting and changing. changing. Since, Since we're, we're not, not physically adept, adept we, we trade, trade our, our services, services for protection. protection. What is it you do here? I look, I look out, out for the, for the best, best interests, interests of the Volos people. people. No, no easy task, task considering how often we are overlooked by the council. Chastising rebuke, Dan. The council favors your species greatly. You are naive. The Earth Clan will be invited to the council long before our species will. Why aren't the Elcor or Volus part of the council? All species must prove themselves before they join the Council. All but the Earth Clans, it would seem. Dismissive. Ignore the Volus Ambassador, human. He is incorrect in his assessment. Really? How long have we been waiting? How long do you think we'll continue to wait? Bah, this is talk is wasted on the humans. Goodbye, Goodbye, Ambassador. Ambassador. Yes, good day, Earth Clan. <clears throat> These things always reminded me of Rama. If any of you guys have played that, it's a very, very old game series and books. is fantastic. Have we met before? No, but I know you well enough. I'm Executive Pal, head of CSEC. It's, it's my job, job to know when someone, someone like you arrives on the Citadel. Citadel. Was there Was something you need to do, man? I get I the feeling you're not, you're not too fond, fond of humans. humans. No, no, I just you don't, don't trust, trust your kind. Not, not yet. yet. You humans are eager to take all the power you can get, yet. and you're being you given a lot. The Council wants to make humanity their favorite pet. That's their business. But I don't have to like it. 
The council treats us like second-class citizens. We have to fight for everything we get. Good. Then fight for it. But don't expect the rest of us to just sit back and let you take it. I'm a busy man, Commander. Are we done here? What do you know about the Spectres? They're the right hand of the council, so they like my call. More like the underhand inside of the council. What do you have against the Spectres? I can't, I can't abide, abide any organization that considers itself above the law, especially when it's left up to each individual specter to decide when and how to bend the rules. Sometimes you have to bend the law to keep people safe. I've been with CSEC for 30 years. I've never had to break the law to do my job, not once. Yeah, right. You expect, you expect us to believe none, none of your officers, officers are corrupt? corrupt? There are over 200,000 CSEC agents. Some of them are going to be bad. But we but don't we turn a blind eye to corruption like the Spectres do. We do, we do our, our best, best to find and punish any officer who breaks the law. Spectres. They'll never come under that kind of scrutiny. The galaxy, the galaxy needs people like that. People, people who do, do the dirty jobs. I agree. But they need to be held to a higher standard. They need to be accountable. Sarah's out of control. We both know that. But because he's a Spectre, the Council doesn't want to do anything about it. Is that, that the kind of person this galaxy needs? But, but not all specters are like Saren. True. True. But, but the potential, potential is always there. there. Tell me Tell about CSEC. CSEC provides, provides necessary police and security services throughout the Citadel. We're a civilian government, government agency, though many of our members have had military training. training. Of course, as the CSEC representative of the Council, I spend most of my time in the A.E. between the two. Tell me, Tell me about your about investigation, investigation into Saren. Sorry, Commander. I don't make a habit of giving out details about ongoing investigations. I'll be I'll going, going now. now. Goodbye, Commander. Before I check your computers. Something, something I can do, do for, for you. you. Relax, Relax Private. Private. This, this is, is an inspection. inspection. Right. right. Sorry. What can, what can I, do I do for you, Commander? Commander? What, can, what you can you tell me about, about the Asari Consort? consort? I, uh... Well, well she's, she's an Asari who works, works here, here as... as that is, she, she helps, helps people, people with, with things. things. You never, you never want to see it, did you? I, uh... No, I never did. I couldn't afford it. It costs half a year's credits just to go in and talk to her. Can you at least tell me where I can find her? Sure. sure. She's, She's across, across the bridge, the bridge from, from the embassies. embassies. Thanks, Thanks, kid. kid. Have, Have fun. fun. Try, Try not, not to get in too, too much, much trouble. trouble. I will. I will. Have fun, Have fun then. Then.
So far, I'm digging the uh, everything that they did. So we'll save here. Thank you.